Hey guys, it's Prince Rich with Rich Technology Group, and in today's video, we are going to be talking about, well, you know what, before I even tell you what we're going to talk about, let me give you guys a little bit of a backstory. So over the past, I would say maybe three to four months, I have gotten calls from different people of all different industries that say, hey, Prince, you know, I found you online. Do you know of, or do you have any recommendations for any sort of like text messaging or bulk text messaging communications platform that's integrated with a voice over IP phone system so that we can communicate with our clients and internal staff via text. It's no secret to anyone that nowadays, you know, especially with the younger generations and all that, text messaging is becoming in some ways and for some businesses and individuals more popular than the actual phone call. So today we're going to talk about a new platform that Broad Voice has recently launched called Bubble. Um, at the time of this video, I think this platform is only, how old would you guys say it is at this point? Uh, one week. <laughs> okay, so it's only about a week old, so you're getting to see something that is not only fresh off the press, but it's cutting edge. And of course, who better to show you guys a live demo of this platform and explain to you the advantages of it to your business than today I have with me, Chris Young and Kathleen Anito with Broad Voice. How are you guys doing today? Doing good. Great. So before we hop into this demo and talk about what Bubble is and show the audience, you know, what it can do and the advantages of why they may want this for their, you know, internal and external text messaging communications, can each of you kind of just tell the audience what your role is at Broad Voice? And then also just for those of the viewers who aren't familiar with who Broad Voice is, tell them kind of what you guys are as a company, what you do and what you offer in a nutshell. Hey, I'm Kathleen Anito. I'm the channel manager here at Broad Voice in the Northeast. Um, and a little bit about, you know, who is Broad Voice? Who are we? We specialize in the SMB marketplace. So that's typically defined as a thousand seats or under. However, um, our sweet spot is 250 seats or less. That's really where we play nicely in the sandbox, shall we say. Um, so that's a tiny bit about who Broad Voice is. Cool, cool, cool. What about you, Chris? What's your what's your role at uh, Broad Voice? So I am the sales engineer. I am the facilitator of all technical information and answering the questions. And if there's ever a demo or anything like that for a quote or anything that Kathleen needs, that's what I'm here for. Yeah. And for those of you who are watching, you are about to see exactly why Chris is here for today's demo. Because when they showed me what Bubble was. I was super duper impressed, but I know when I looked at all that it was capable of doing and how it could help customers with their, you know, bulk or individual text or SMS communications or MMS communications, I thought, okay, I definitely am going to need Chris to do a demo on this because I wouldn't know the first thing about how to dive into this. So anyways, <clears throat> without further ado, Chris, if you want to go ahead and share your screen, um, I'm going to hand this over to you completely and let yeah. you just kind of give the audience an overview of what this platform is, what it does, and just how it, you know, how the customers can benefit from what its functions are. Yeah, and I'm actually just going to pull up my screen real quick and show you guys um, basically hey, hey, what well, we're Chris looking at. Hey, while Chris is pulling up his and screen. And I was going to say, Kathleen, I just wanted you to touch on some things. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> oh, sure. No, go for it. I know I was just going to say that, um, you know, some statistics and some things that are interesting are the fact that um, text messaging has a 98% delivery rate and an, excuse me, 98% open rate and a 95% read rate, which I think is huge. Um, and it's a great way to get your message out there to your end users, whether it's customers or patients or anyone. Um, and I know that they have a, with text messaging, the stats are, it's a 45% response rate and a 75% engagement rate. Wow. Wow. That's, that's definitely bigger than email for sure. Yeah. That's definitely, <laughs> definitely bigger than email and probably bigger than people answering their phones consistently at that kind of a rate <laughs> before somebody goes to you voicemail. Announce junk mail. <laughs> <laughs> True. I almost don't check my personal email because I know that's all it is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good point. So, um, all right, so I'm going to get, get into a demo and we're just going to cover high level what Bubble can do and some of the functionality. Um, 
for those of you watching on the right hand side is my bubble interface on the left hand side is a web based uh, platform that I'm receiving the text messages on so you guys can see in real time what those messages look like and what the responses look like. So, um, first of all, when you're managing bubble there's a, a lot of different things you can do. Um, the first and and most important thing in my mind is managing your contacts and putting them into the correct silos. So when you're managing a contact, you pop over to this contacts page here. I've got a list of my different contacts and I apologize if it's a little visually condensed, but I'll pull up the contact that we're gonna be working with today. Uh, it's called Vet Dude. Um, and from here, uh, when I click on Vet Dude, I can see the, I'll be able to see the information associated with him. So I'll be able to see his email address, fax number, as dated as that is, time zone, home address, uh, business address, so on and so forth. And then the most important thing about the contact, at least in my opinion, is the tag. Now, the importance of the tag is this what allows you to search for contacts based on these tags. Think of them just like you would hashtags for any sort of social media post or anything like that. So in this case, I've tagged this contact called vet with the tag cars. Now, where that comes into play is when I go over to my text cast interface, and this is going to be the primary point that I use for most of my manually generated text messages. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to type in the word cars. I'll see that tag there, type search. And then from here, I'll have a list of everybody that matches that tag for cars. Now, in this case, I've only have one contact for that. So they're already selected. And then from here, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to select an existing template that I've previously created to send them out a little text reminder. Now, you can see here in the message field it says, hello first name. So what it's going to do is it's actually going to say to that person first name, and then it's going to put or whatever their first name is in the contact field that is. And then it's going to put down whatever uh, message I have down below there. And then down here, this is what phone number it's going to come from. Um, so right now I'm just going to go, go ahead and quickly send that just to show you guys a little functionality. So you get the, your message has been queued to send. You can navigate away from this page as your message goes out. And then now on the left-hand side, momentarily, you guys will see that text message come in. And then once that comes in, we'll kind of move on to the next little part there. Um, there's also a time text component as well. Um, so you have the ability to um, kind of schedule these and everything like that. So if you want it to go out like say minutes or hours from now, you have the ability to do that. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and check my phone here and make it up. Oh, there it goes, hello vet. You see there it says, hello vet. That's the first name of the contact as it's entered. We are running a special promotion. And then the message came through. So now if I wanted to go ahead and do that, I'm gonna do that, but I'm gonna schedule it out a little bit and go search again. Let's go find my template again. But this time I'm gonna do what's called a time text. So in this case, I'm gonna say, I wanna send it five minutes from now. Now, as I get through the demo, you guys will see it pop through on the left-hand side and I'll make sure to draw your attention to it when we get there. But you can do things like you can say, oh, I wanna do it at a specific date and time, or I can do it delayed from now. Um, in this case, I'm just gonna do a little bit of delay. So I'll go ahead and schedule that. And in about five or so minutes, you'll see that little message pop up here on the left-hand side. So that's some of the kind of basic functionality of sending the text out. Uh, one of the other things that a lot of people like to leverage this for is the ability to send texts to a number to get an interactive response. So in this case, I've added a keyword here called Corvette. And when I type in that word, it'll actually generate an automatic response back from the system based on what I've configured and it'll allow my customer to interact with it. So you can say for parts and service, press one. For consultation on making more power baby, press two. And learn the secrets of going fast, press three. So in this case, if I type in one of those responses, I'll get a message back and I'll say type three. And then once it gets response back, there'll be an automated response back to that. And it'll have some clever message that I came up with and said the key wait, wait. has to be first. I got a question about that. that. <laughs> so so you're so you're telling me that with this software you can create preset commands on the numeric yep. pad. So like, for yep. example, uh, we'll just use a one thing that I get calls from that could benefit from a software like this the most is pharmacies. They need to send out texts to people automatically or, you know, in groups or individually about a prescription that's ready or prescription that needs a refill or something like that. So you're mm -hmm. saying like you could actually program something in this scenario that says like, you know, for more information or for the number that you need to call about a refill, press one. Uh, if you're, if you have questions or issues with your prescription, press two, and it can have different responses that have been preset up and predetermined in the bubble system in the back end, is what you're telling exactly. me. Exactly. Yep. That is 
incredible. Sorry to cut you off, but I, I had to, I, I had to touch on that because that is incredible. And this, and this would be something that that person interacts with this individual or this client in this scenario interacts with on their regular cell phone. Correct. Yeah. So this is just all this interface here on the left hand side. This is just a program that allows me to text from my cell phone through the web. This would be just as if I were to pick up my phone and just start texting from it as well. Gotcha. Gotcha. That's impressive. Didn't mean to cut you off, but I, I had to, no. <laughs> I had to ask about that. That's, that's incredible. <laughs> yeah. The other cool thing about this is that as an agent for working for the entity, I can now see those text interactions here. So as an example, I'm going to just go, go ahead and type Corvette again. And then I should see the text come up here. Um, there we go there. And now I can grab it. And I, as the employee, I'm going to take ownership of that. And I can now interact with that person. I could say, yeah, hey, I saw you were interested in the Corvette or whatever. And then you'll see. So now I can use this almost like an online chat function as well. That is incredible. And then I could do things like with this, uh, so I could transfer it to a pathway that does some sort of automated helping, or I could transfer it over to another agent or another key or whatever may have you. In this case, I'm just going to go ahead and close it out, and that closes out the dialogue. I can also have like an automated close message too, so that whenever that close part happens, it could say, you know, thanks for coming to, to, to Corvette Fast Parts, you know, you know, keep us in mind for all your speed needs or something like that. So there, there's a, those kind of cool functions there as well. Um, I'm not sure if you guys caught that, but midway through going through that, we saw that text delayed message came come through as well. So yeah. So that that we were talking about. So you can see that. Um, and there's a lot of other things that I can I can do with this system. I can do bulk and importing of contacts. So if you have like an existing client directory, all you got to do is get that into a CSV format, and then you can import it. You can already add in um, as long as you already have the tags added on our system as you're importing them. You can say, okay, well this tag or this contact is tagged with prescriptions and and uh, scheduling, and this tag is is or this contact is tagged with appointments and scheduling, or et cetera, et cetera. And you can do that all in a bulk Im import. Um, so you don't have to worry about adding each individual client manually. Um, there's other functionality you can do as well that if somebody were to text to a number, um, if they text like a keyword like info or something like that, it could it could say, oh, if this is a new client, go ahead and create a contact and then tag them info or whatever or new client. And then you can kind of sort through things and 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 some based on that. And one of the more powerful things is you can do things like reminders based on different tags and different variables. Wow. The system is infinitely complex and I, I could probably go on and show you guys things for about an hour, but at a high level, I just kind of want to kind of put the seeds out there and show you guys what, what some of its uh, basic functionality as well as plan ideas for, like I said, that advanced functionality and what it can do. Gotcha. This, um, the only other question that I had, unless you had some other things you wanted to show in the system, this supports SMS, obviously. Does it also support MMS, like photos, yes. things like that, yes, video? It does. Yeah, and I'm not sure if you saw that when I go, let's say go back to that, that uh, just that basic texting here. Uh, I'll go pick that person, and I'll toggle MMS, and then I can click the ability to upload that image. Wow, that's, that's game breaking right there. That's, that's pretty impressive. Yeah. So that makes it kind of cool. I, I was experimenting with it. You can see here, I sent <laughs> of, a, of a Corvette <laughs> just, just to goof around. Um, so, but yeah, you do have the ability to do that. Nice, yeah, nice. You know, you know so I was talking to somebody last week and the way they were going to utilize this tool was um, um, around their park. Um, hey, text this number and we're going to send you a 10% um, off coupon for our food at the food court. Hey, and then if you keep walking, text this number and we're going to send you, a, um, you know, $5 off for your next visit just to keep people engaged. Yeah. It's just, it's just a different marketing tool. That's impressive. Yeah. And, and then it, it's neat because back to the numeric commands that you can pre-set up on the back end of Bubble, it's right. neat that like if somebody texted it, you know, it could have something that says, you know, do you want to know what our location is? Do you know want to know what our specials are? Do you want to know what our hours of operation are? And all they have to do from their personal cell phone or business cell phone is just dial a number to be able to get that information. So that that's that's truly impressive. 
Yeah, and this is what that this is kind of what that interface looks like. One of the limitations is it is only based on numeric responses at the time being, so you have to configure it like in you know press one for this, press two for that. But that's not that different from interacting with any sort of IVR today. You know, yeah, same type of thing. So yeah, and you can keep I can keep adding a bunch of different options in here, and I can totally customize this as much as I want. I have a weird question. Uh, those responses. Does it have the ability for you to put a link in there? Like if, uh, like if yeah. one said something like, you know, to for for more information on our website, go here. If they pr press one and then it sends a link, is that would it be an actual clickable link on the on the recipient's end? So go Corvette. And now bear in mind, I that was a hidden. I didn't actually specify that they have to press four to do this, but since I know I configured four, so I'll just press four. And then we'll see the response back. Oh my gosh, it's a clickable link. That's awesome. That is impressive. We don't um, know what Chris's hobbies are, right? <laughs> <laughs> Technical guru stuff and Corvettes. And I'm not right, sure right, if you yeah. guys can see it. Uh, no, the camera's wigging out. But yeah, it is a clickable link on my phone as well. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, that actually, Kathleen, you mentioned something earlier about a, a particular customer example. And that actually brings me into what I believe is my last question that I have for you guys, unless there's any other features that you want to show before we jump into concluding this video, could you guys just give maybe like a small handful, like maybe a few examples? I know the product is new, but give me some examples of some scenarios or types of customers that you guys feel would benefit most from this. Like what type of scenario or or what type of specific industry? Do you want to take that, Kathleen? I mean, honestly, I think every industry. I think healthcare, number one. Yeah. Um, you know, doctors and pharmacies, like you were saying before. Um, and then uh, pharmacies, that falls underneath that. I would say retail, for sure. Yeah. Um, yeah, like, I mean, like drug I, marketing I campaigns like talking about hot sales or flash sales or whatever. Yeah. That's a, that's a really good point. I didn't think about that. That's a really good point. Like I, I could see this thing being a huge hit, <laughs> this software platform being like a must have for businesses that thrive off of things like black Friday sales and after Christmas sales and things like right. that. This is, this is huge. Yeah. This is huge. Well, that's all the questions that I've got for you guys. Is there anything else that you'd like to say about the bu the new bubble platform or to the viewers about this platform or any other features that you'd like to touch on um probably one of the other big uh big industries that's going to be very popular with the schools um because the schools back in the day they used to have to do that mass telephone call to update people now you don't even need to worry about it you just do the mass text messaging and it can go out all at the same you don't have to worry about establishing phone call paths and everything like that so that's another really good fit for this product that's a really good point. I didn't even think about that. And it's like this day and age, what parent and what kid at least maybe like middle school and up doesn't have a cell phone. And especially exactly. the kids doesn't check the cell phone probably all day long, even in school when they, when they shouldn't be on the phone to begin with. <laughs> so no, I, I want to really thank both, uh, both of you, Chris and Kathleen for being here today. This, um, I am truly impre impressed with this platform and, um, I'd actually probably like to do some other videos with you guys on this platform specific to some industries where we can we can jump into some dig a bit deeper for some of the audience that may be watching saying, you know what, this looks really neat, but I wonder just how I wonder just how it can be tailored for me for, you know, my pharmacy or my private school or my public school district or whatever. So um but anyways, I want to truly thank you guys for being here uh for this. If um if you're watching this video and you found this platform uh, interesting, as mu or at least as much as I did, um, if you're interested in chatting with Chris or Kathleen or the team at Broad Voice to see a more in-depth demo, like Chris mentioned, there's a whole lot more layers uh, you know, of advantages and of technicalities of what this system can do. If you're interested in seeing a more in-depth demo that's more personalized for your business or your scenario, and of course, getting a quote, uh, for what this would look like price-wise for your business, give me a shout and I'll connect you up directly with Chris and Kathleen. Um, if you found this video helpful, please like the video, subscribe to our channel. We upload three new videos every single week. Uh, 
As always, Prince Rich, your go-to guy for the best deals on business, phone, and internet service in the United States. I'll talk to you guys again in the next video.